The day is here. The match everyone has been talking about, and with good reason. Two teams of strong pedigree, rich in talent, on the cusp of going head-to-head -head in a highly significant confrontation with so much to play for. How will it pan out? Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you from Manchester here on EA TV Live. And here we are at one of the great venues for football anywhere in the world, Old Trafford in Manchester. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Manchester United up against West Ham United. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. This is the team Manchester United will go with. Casemiro plays alongside Bruno Fernandes in central midfield. And the focal point in attack today, Marcus Rashford. And play halted, free kick given. And a look at the West Ham 11. Alphonse Areola begins in goal. Vladimir Tsofal starts with Emerson in the fullback positions. James Ward Prowse plays alongside Edison Alvarez in the centre of midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Now he must favour the cross. But he knew he had to get to the ball, and he did. Well, he's a player who just seems to get better and better. I'm talking, of course, about Bruno Fernandes. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him in this game? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-tubes around his marker and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. Well, on you go, says the referee. Advantage. The cross is on, and space available inside. It might be. Oh, last-ditch defending at its very finest. Anthony. More than decent this from United. But they took care of the situation defensively. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle, and the referee has got to book him, I think. But it is a caution, and quite frankly, he can't really quibble. No, it's been coming, hasn't it? He's got to be careful now. He could get a red if he's not careful. <whistles> and nicely over the top. And a good take under duress there. Lisandro Martinez. Promising sequence. Corner given to United. Now sending it in. And a goal! Well, here's the replay. It's certainly a well-delivered ball into the area. And then what a great finish as well. Good connection with the ball, leaving the keeper with little chance. It's a great goal. Well, it's a big moment for Eric Ten Hag. He now just needs to get his team refocused and concentrate on the game. So West Ham get us moving again. And a swift response required after the setback. Casemiro, really good challenge. And space for West Ham in the wide position. 
This could square the game, but the keeper has his say. And how important could that be in the grand scheme of things? Well, that was a big chance, and really, he should have taken that. But let's give credit to the goalkeeper. It's a decent save. Corner kick played in. And that's very confident goalkeeping in not easy circumstances. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, could be. And it's in for Manchester United. They are on a victory course. Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. And the referee allowing the game to flow, using advantage. Oh, great defending. Marcus Rashford. Anthony. Rashford, he must finish! Able to close down the shot. <laughs> Who can they pick out? Making sure nothing came of it. And on the back of that particular challenge, will the referee let the matter rest there? And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved a yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Anthony. Chance to play it in. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Emerson. And play halted, free kick given. Good through ball. Read that pass all the way, cutting it out. I don't think he'll be proud of that challenge, and it's left to the referee to decide what happens next. Well, he has been dismissed, and it was going so well. Well, that's going to make it interesting now. He's just put his team under pressure here. gone out and it is going to be a goal kick well truth be told he's only had a very limited influence on this game Stuart yeah I've been really disappointed with him today Derek he just hasn't looked himself but I think it's fair to say he hasn't had great service has he here's Luke Shaw Almost at half-time, and they're making home advantage count, I think it's fair to say. Stuart, your thoughts? 
Well, they're dominating this first half. Their approach play, their cleverness around the box and the finishing have been excellent. They just need to continue this going into the second period. And defensive play to be applauded. Kurt Zuma. Vladimir Tsofal. And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. Running with the ball confidently. And players waiting in the centre. It's a perfect challenge. Emerson. And so the referee blows the whistle. We've reached the halfway point here at Old Trafford. This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I really liked his first half display. He was certainly the most influential player on the field. And I'm expecting more of the same in the second 45 minutes. So the ball moving again. United having already made a big first half statement. Casemiro. Ward Prowse. Lucas Paqueta. Intelligent threaded pass here. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Casemiro. Now Casemiro. And in the right position to make sure it didn't go all the way through. Quite possibly a yellow card as the flow was stopped. But it is a caution and stay calm might be the instructions that should come from the manager. Yeah, you're absolutely right. If they're not careful, they're going to lose another player fairly soon. Well, after pressing like that, maybe the short route to goal. A chance to whip it in. Opportunity for them to get back into the game. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Playing it in, on a corner like that, every goalkeeper's dream, really. High pressing at its best. Casemiro. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Could be threatening. He just needs to stay level-headed now. Opportunity still there. And a goal! Not over just yet. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. Well, 2-1 it is here. So, a half an hour remaining. Rashford. Rafael Varane. 
Well, they keep the ball moving. Casemiro, really fine piece of defending play to break us up. A foul, but advantage played. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. Rashford. And the free kick awarded to Manchester United. Here's a change for Manchester United. And he whips it in. Well, the danger is still there. Well, perhaps not a high percentage chance for him. Well, although he was always going to be second to the ball, the defender just about did enough to stop him getting a clean header there. Rashford unable to hold it. Well, the fans want to see a shot. And missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space. Well, that should have made it more comfortable, shouldn't it? But it's a wasted opportunity. And into the last 20 minutes. And West Ham have the ball again. Counter-attacking chance. He's in here. Dallo. And maybe Rashford's foiling his opponent completely. They have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Over it comes. Well, not away properly. Casimiro. Baran. Nicely timed tackle. United might be able to cash in. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Not giving him a moment's peace. So far. Can they take advantage? Well, using the space really well, you've got to say. Cornet. That is how to keep it out of the net. And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Now, looking dangerous here. Encouraging stuff from United. Kept it out, fully stretched, somehow reaching it. Here it is now, a substitution. Corner kick played in. Well, the main thing is to thump it away. And problem solved for now. And an astute piece of defending. And nearing full time, United inching ever closer to victory. Can they hang on? Stuart, your thoughts as regards their performance? Well, they should have had this wrapped up long ago. Oh, sorry, Stuart, look at this. In it goes to increase their advantage. And will that be the goal that ends up securing it for them?
Jared Bowen. Anthony. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. And maybe Rashford. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out the danger. And holding on to it at the second time of asking. Trying to open up the defence. Shot blocked, but still alive. And a fine stop. And the keeper nowhere to be found. Not that he's complaining. Well, as you can see, the defending is really poor, but he won't mind. It's a simple finish for him. And there goes the final whistle. Manchester United are the winners today anyway. What did you think of their performance, all told? You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. And I think it's fair to say he'll be happy with his own contribution in this game, Stuart. Well, he scored a good goal, and if I was his coach, I certainly wouldn't be worried by him missing a couple of chances. The fact is, he was a constant threat today.